name's Savannah, I'm a second year maths student at the University of Nottingham and today I wanted to talk to you about why I decided to choose a maths degree. So one of the big things that I didn't actually know when I was applying but I know now I'm at uni and looking at job prospects and things after uni is that a maths degree I can literally do anything with, it offers so much versatility and people will say this to you but now I know it's like actually true. So for example, I want to study a philosophy masters after my maths degree. It's something I'm interested in. I'd like to study philosophy of science and doing a maths degree is a good prerequisite for that. Whereas if it were the other way around and I was doing a philosophy degree, I probably wouldn't be able to go and do a maths masters. I'd probably have to completely like retrain and do a new degree. As well as that, I'm also interested in linguistics and I did for a time consider doing a master's in linguistics and again, maths was a great prerequisite for that. Perhaps the entry requirements for linguistics were something like you should have a degree in maths, computer science or modern language, something like that. And as well as that, I can do jobs in physics or engineering or computing. So with a maths degree, I could go into video game developing or roller coaster designing <laughs> or if I wanted I could go into astronomy and a maths degree opens up all those different pathways for me. I could even do law I think. I can go into actuarial sciences, I can do a GDL. It just opens so many doors at postgraduate level but as well at a job level. Often a maths degree or some sort of STEM degree will be a requirement for a lot of good jobs and even if it's not, a maths degree will still be looked upon very favourably. If you're not sure what career you want to do yet and you need to pick a subject for uni, go for one you like and if you like maths then I would say definitely go for that. But I'm biased. <laughs> so another reason I chose a maths degree is because obviously I like maths. I like problem solving. I didn't used to be good at maths which I've spoken about in previous videos Videos. but even before that I'd always loved like logic puzzles and doing like lots of Professor Layton puzzles and things that required logic and thinking through. So I think I've always had that logical mindset even when I wasn't good at maths. And yeah, I enjoy like solving problems and I enjoy what I get to study in my maths degree. At Nottingham I can study really cool like quantum physics in my maths degree which I love. <laughs> And even in my second year of my maths degree, we're looking at things like modelling traffic and things and you can like model diseases and stuff and it's really cool that I can do that in my second year. That's another career we can go into actually like medical sciences stuff. You could definitely go into that with a maths degree as well. So this reason is less of a reason why I chose a maths degree but more of an unexpected bonus I suppose and that's I can get a lot of support doing a maths degree. There's lots and lots of literature online uh, teaching you maths and things. If you don't understand a topic, chances are you can just search it and lots of different things will come up about it. Whereas if you're studying a more obscure topic in another subject that might not come up. So I know I was speaking to my boyfriend the other day and with some maths things he was stuck on, he found videos in Hindi that explained it really well and because he understood Hindi he could watch those videos and actually get quite a lot from it. So there's lots of help available online and at university as well when you're studying a maths degree, like maths departments tend to be quite big as well so there's a lot of people around who can help which is really great. And again this next reason is just an unexpected bonus I guess of choosing a maths degree but it's kind of nice that when you tell people you're doing a maths degree they're all like ooh maths you know. <laughs> they seem like quite impressed or they'll be like oh I could never do that. Um, <laughs> nice small ego boost I suppose that comes sometimes. But yeah, um, that's not why I picked maths at all. And adding on to that being a woman in STEM, a woman in maths, it's really great that I can get my face out there as representation as well as that doing study tube sort of things as well. It's good, I feel, that I can show that women can, I guess, do maths and it's like normal because even though perhaps most of you watching you're like, well, yeah, obviously, there are still some misconceptions and things um, and women still face a lot of sort of What's the word? Is it oppression? <laughs> I don't know, I can't remember the word, but women still face a lot of obstacles, that's the word. Women still face a lot of obstacles in academia. I'm hoping that I can encourage more girls and women to get into maths and STEM and 
yeah, that would be great. That's a bonus as well if I do that. So yeah, so that's basically all my reasons. Um, if you're doing a maths degree or whatever degree you're doing, I'd really like to know why you chose your degree. And if you have any questions about doing a maths degree or studying at Nottingham, you can always pop it in the comments and I'll do my best to reply. Thanks for watching everyone. Bye!